we are going to have a variable right here in one spot only and a bunch of stuff that gets done to it and a inequality symbol and a total or something right so same as dealing with multi-step equations you can identify each of the things that gets done to the variable in order so first thing that is done to t is minus seven this is just order of operations then the second thing that is done is after we have that times three third thing that is done to the variable we have three times all that then plus 19 and lastly we have after we finish with the numerator divide by eight those are the four things that are done to the variable you're going to undo those things in the opposite order so i'm going to undo divide by eight with a times eight i'm going to undo plus 19 with a minus 19 i will undo times three with a divide by three and I will undo minus seven with a plus seven, okay? The problem creator, use the order of operations, and you will use opposite steps, opposite order. So this is how it works. Times eight gets rid of a divide by eight, times eight over here, keeps the balance of the inequality and we'll have 5 times 8 is 40. Minus 19 gets rid of a plus 19. Minus 19 over here keeps the balance and we will have 21. Divide by 3 rid of times 3. Divide by 3 over here keeps the balance. We'll have 7. Lastly, plus 7. Gets rid of a minus 7. Plus 7 over here keeps the balance. And we have leftover t is greater than or equal to 14. Graphing that, T is allowed to equal the number in question, so we'll shade in a circle at 14, and T is also allowed to be bigger than 14, so we'll shade toward the larger numbers on the number line. That is solving a multi-step inequality. We'll do a second example. Same idea, start at the variable. What happens to it? First we subtract six, then we multiply by five, then we add two, multiply by negative four, and lastly, subtract 18. Put a star at this multiplication step because if you remember, anytime we multiply or divide by a negative number, when we're dealing with inequalities, it's going to cause that inequality symbol to flip around. All right, undoing these steps, we will undo minus 18 with a plus 18. We'll undo times negative 4 with a divide by negative 4, we'll undo plus 2 with a minus 2, we will undo times 5 with a, uh, not with a times, with a divide by 5, and lastly we will undo minus 6 with a plus 6. That's the plan.
opposite steps in the opposite order. So plus 18 gets rid of a minus 18. 42 plus 18 is 60. Divide by negative 4 gets rid of a times negative 4. Divide by negative 4 gives us a negative 15. And because we're dividing both sides by a negative number, we are flipping the direction of the inequality. Minus 2 gets rid of a plus 2. Divide by 5. Gets rid of a times 5. Plus 6. Gets rid of a minus 6. And strictly bigger than 2.6. not allowed to equal 2.6 open circle it's allowed to be bigger than 2.6 shade above multi-step inequalities